Aloha everybody. In this video, I want to start a fire with solar ignition using just the sun and a magnifying glass and natural tender. Now this is a five power magnifying glass. Uh, you need a five power or higher, I would suggest maybe even a 10 uh, power magnifying glass. And you'll need plenty of sun. I like to use magnifying glasses um, to start a fire uh, around noon, you know, like 11 to 2 o'clock, right when the sun is directly overhead. Of course, during the day, you can't start it at night. It's just not going to work. And your tinder can't be like a light color. Um, for instance, you can't start uh, a fire using magnifying glass with a cotton ball, for instance. You're, it'll just reflect the, the light and the heat. Now, in the jungle, you can find openings in the canopy, and starting a fire with a magnifying glass in the desert would obviously be easier. You just have to watch for the wind, because sometimes wind can be an enemy. Don't go away. I've got some coconut husk here. Let's start a fire with this. And a magnifying glass. Get it zeroed in. Wow, already smoking. It's uh, a little after noon. I think it's about 1.30. And Hawaii, or where I'm at, it's about 13 degrees from the equator. So, it's pretty intense. And this is just a five magnifying glass, or strength five. I'm gonna stop talking and focus. There we go. It's going pretty good. Yeah, pretty easy. Better close this thing. I don't want it to accidentally catch fire. But you can see these little magnifying glass apparatus thingies. Pretty cool. Start a fire with that. Easy. I just got a little sunburn. That's all it took, really. And some dry tinder and coconut husk, if you watch my channel, is one of my favorite tenders to use to start a fire. Uh, either bow drill or flint and steel or ferrocene rod good old coconut husk right off the tree works great you saw in the video I use coconut husk right from the tree and this works brilliant it's very fibrous you can break it up uh, really well and make uh, dust out of it a fine dust 
and uh, you know dry grass will work as well and various other uh, tinder will work now when you use a magnifying glass just remember to get it focused and where it's that bright uh, light focused right on the tinder and you want it to be you know as uh, fibrous or as dusty as possible and sunglasses actually help because it kind of like reflects in your eye and it kind of you know burns a, a spot in your eye kind of you know you know what I mean so this isn't my favorite way to start a fire this is basically like a backup to a backup to a backup you know or to a backup you know what I mean because I like a lighter ferrocium rod flint and steel uh, and then um, matches and then I guess this and then bow drill would be like uh, a, a chart of the easiest to start a fire right uh, this is definitely easier than a bow drill but not as easy as like with a lighter for instance because this is limited you're limited on the time that you can do it and if it's cloudy or you're in the jungle with a deep heavy canopy you're not going to be able to use this or at night you just so this is very limited starting a fire with a magnifying glass obviously but it can be done with natural material. So I hope you like this video. Comment below. I'm here for any questions. Please share this video. And I hope you subscribe because I got some more awesome videos coming up. And check me out on Instagram at His Survival. And until next time, Aloha!